so we were uh, we were studying the chapter that is playing with numbers in that we were first dealing with the topic factors and multiple multiples innale padichende oru repeat video yum pinne baaki adu kanjittu multiples namukku athre innu kaana this module you would not like to find the factor this and multiples of numbers let's begin with an activity there are six apples let us see how many baskets are required to add these apples equally to begin with if there is only one basket we can pack all six apples in it if there are two baskets we can pack three apples in each so that there are no apples left if there are three baskets we can still divide the six apples equally two apples can be packed in each basket so that there are no apples left now if we have four baskets we have a problem after packing one apple in each basket there are still two apples left Thus, we cannot divide six apples equally in four baskets. If the number of baskets is five, we still have a problem. One apple can be packed in each basket, and there is still one apple left. If the number of baskets is six, then. We can again divide the six apples equally among them. One apple can be packed in each basket. There are no apples remaining. Observe the table carefully. Note that when we divide six apples among one, two, three, or six baskets, there are no apples left. This is because the numbers 1 2 3 and 6 completely divide the number 6 without leaving a remainder no say that the numbers 1 3 and 6 are factors the number 6 an exact divisor of a number is called its factor now let us take a closer look at the factors of the number 6 and find some interesting things about factors we know that any number divided by 1 is equal to the number itself we can also say that 1 is the exact divisor of every number thus 1 is a factor of every number every number divided by itself is equal to 1 we can say that every number is an exact divisor of itself thus every number is a factor of itself which is the highest factor of the number 6 it is the number 6 itself all other factors of 6 are less than 6 this is true for all numbers the factors of a number are either less than or equal to the number itself as the factors of a number cannot be greater than the number itself all the factors of a number would lie between 1 and the given number thus all numbers have a finite number of factors before we move on let's take another number and find its factors let's find the factors of the number 75 1 into 75 is equal to 75 3 into 25 is equal to 75 5 into 15 is equal to 75 15 into 5 is equal to 75 you can stop right here when you reach a combination where the factors start getting repeated 
you need not look for any more combinations. Thus, the factors of 75 are 1, 3, 5, 15, 25, and 75. Okay, so till here we have uh, seen yesterday. Uh, so the uh, some peculiarity or some speciality of the factor we will study in that. But now we are all number one factor is okay. Okay, if I am taking a number, the number itself will be its factor. Right, if six is there, then six is one factor. Six is one factor. Same way, if I am taking seventy-five, the number seventy-five is its factor. Okay, so one is a factor of every number. The number itself is a factor of, of that number. Okay, either end. Pinna bedsendana, the number of factors will be finite. And either Namaka count the ambatum, etra factors on done. Uripa 75 edu and angel Namka count the barayam. It has six factors. Now the bola than Namka barayam, the factors of 75 is lying less than. 75. 75 is not 75 is factors. That is 1 and 75 is 75 is factors. That is why we are here. Okay. So, we are factors in the speciality and uh, peculiarity. Okay. Now, the next thing that we are going to see is the multiples. Okay. Now, what do you mean by multiples? That is what we are going to see. Here is another interesting observation. Note that each factor of number 75 is multiplied by another factor to get the result as 75. Thus the number 75 is a multiple of all its factors. Okay, so here they are telling us 75 into 1 jidu. 75 into 1 jidu, we have answer in the gitti, 75 gitti. Okay, so e the 75 is the factor of 1 and 75. The same way if I am doing, I am taking this one. That is 3 into 25. So 3 into 25 is in the answer is 75. So this 75 is the multiple of 3 and 25. 3 and 25 in the multiple of 75. That is one number. Now I am adding 25. 25 is 25 into 1 is 25. 25 into 2 is 50. Okay, so 25, 50, 75, 100, we have multiples in the number. That's why we have to do numbers. That's why we have to do 6. So 6 is 6 into 1. 6 into 1 is 6. Now 6 into 2. 6 into 2 is 12. So 6, 12, 18. Okay, like that, it, these are the multiples of 6. 6 in a multiples, we can say 6 in a table. We can say 6 in a table, we can say 6 in a table. That is 6 in a multiples. But 2 in a multiples, we can say 2 in a multiples, 2, 4, 6, 8. That is one table, we can say 2 into 1, 2, 2 into 2, 4, 2 into 3. Six like that. Our table na the gitan the gairing la ana a number ne multiples endu varai nu. Okay, so seven. Yes. Ida erdi erga na. Ah, ida e last sentence. Ba kela nengal ida le erdi erda na. E last sentence ana namke nengal la lado. So seventy five is the multiple of one, three, five, fifteen, twenty five, and seventy five. That is uh, the factors. Factors in the multiple namakka. 75 and 75 and the multiple is not the same. So, just this last sentence, rest of the things that you have to get started. So, uh, this is how, well, this is what you mean by the multiples of the numbers. That is number 1, 2, 3, 4, which multiplies, you can get the answers and multiples. Similarly, the factors of 6 are multiplied with other factors of 6 to get 6. Thus, we can say that a number is a multiple of all its factors. Okay, so you can just write this down. The factors of 6 are 1, 2, 3, and 6. So 1, 2, 3, and 6. 1 into 6, chamber 6, 2 into 3, chamber 6, the same way 3 into 2, chamber 6, 6 into 1, chamber 6. So, uh, so we can say the factors, that is, we can say the numbers 1, 2, 3, and 6 are having the multiple 6. 
6 is the multiple of 1, 2, uh, 1, 2, 3 and 6. So a number is a multiple of its factors. Factors in the multiple are number itself. Okay, so just you can write down this one. So uh, the, a number is a multiple of its factors. Factors in the multiples are number. That is number in the factors. Factors in the multiple are number. Yes, another conversation. That the product of every is equal to the number itself. Thus, we can say that every number is a multiple of one and itself. Okay, so uh, now we can see some of the speciality of multiples. Multiples and the speciality and the and either one into any number will give the number itself. One into any number will give the number itself. So we can say that the every number is one multiple of one at itself. Okay. Twelve in the multiple no are another twelve and none. Okay, the same way if I am taking 25, 25 into a multiple in the another 25 than uh, Same way 82 in the 82 into a multiple or I am that is 82 itself. Because when we are multiplying 25 with 1, you will get 25. Okay, so if we are saying that we have a number and if you are fine to uh, write the multiple of the number, Yes, you wish three. What happened? Every number is multiple of itself. That is 25. 25 into a multiple shows that we have 25. That is 500. That is 500 into a multiple. 500. That is 500. The same way, we have 1 into a multiple shows. 1 into a multiple shows. What number is it? That is 1 into a multiple. 2 into a 3 into a 4 into a 1 into a multiple. So every number is a multiple of 1 and itself. Okay, so one into every multiple, Namaka is the number of param, other bole, or a number at the other than a other into multiple on the param. So you can just write this down first. Firstly, just write this down. We just saw that six is a multiple of each of its factors and itself. Now let us find multiples of the number six. Multiple of six with different numbers, we can get different numbers. Multiples of the number six. Okay. So, multiples If you are asked to find the multiple of number six, six in the multiple six into one. And the six. six into two. That is twelve. Six into three. Eighteen. Six into four. Twenty-four. Six into five. Thirty. So, these the answers six in the multiples So, six, twelve, eighteen, twenty-four, and thirty are the multiples of six. Okay. So now I think you understood what you mean by multiples. Multiples in the right of the So here six about number six six and a multiples six into one, six into two, six into three, six into four, six into five, six into six, six into seven, and then number one number. 1, 2, 3, which multiply, the kitten answers. The answers are the multiples. So just write this down fastly. So, yes, okay. so here, the multiples are number, number numbers where numbers are to multiply, the kitten answers are multiple. Numbers are infinite. Hence, we can go on multiplying 6 with greater and still greater numbers to find higher and still higher multiples of six. Thus, there are infinite multiples of number. Okay. Now one more thing. That is infinite numbers of multiple of a number. Okay. So in the very number six at the can angle six in a number one, two, three, which multiply shade the ten, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, and a number multiply shade on the one. Multiply shame over on the answer. Other than the screen, six into one thousand, one thousand and hundred, which multiply, you know, six thousand six hundred and eighty. Be six thousand six hundred in the barain of them six into a multiple. Okay, the same way if you go on multiplying, we will get number of multiples. We will get multiples. That is why we will get the end of the day. 
okay so we are saying that there are infinite numbers of multiples adhaayad count cheyan pattatha athrey multiples namukku undu nu parayam okay so just write down this sentence there are infinite multiples of a number if you are taking a number there are lot of multiples or infinite numbers yes. okay there are infinite multiples of a number or number eduthu kenjal adinte multiples ezhudan parnja namak etra venamengil ezhudan Yes. Okay, so I think all of you have heard it. Before moving on, let's look at another interesting concept. Consider the sum of the factors of the number six. What do we get? We get four, which is equal to two times six. Next. ഓക്കെ സ്റ്റുഡൻസ് ഐ ആം മ്യൂട്ടിംഗ് യു നിങ്ങൾ മ്യൂട്ട് മാറ്റുന്ന എന്തിനാ ഓക്കെ നിങ്ങൾക്ക് സംസാരിക്കാൻ ഉള്ളപ്പോ മാത്രം മ്യൂട്ട് മാറ്റിയാ മതി ഞാൻ നിങ്ങളെ മ്യൂട്ട് ചെയ്തിരിക്കുകയാണ് ഇവിടെ ഡിസ്റ്റർബൻസ് ഉണ്ട് ബാക്ക്ഗ്രൗണ്ടിൽ അതുകൊണ്ടാണ് ഓക്കെ സംസാരിക്കേണ്ട മാത്രം അൺമ്യൂട്ട് ചെയ്താ മതി സോ ഹിയർ വി ആർ സീയിങ് സം അതർ ഇൻട്രസ്റ്റിംഗ് പ്രോപ്പർട്ടീസ് ഓർ അതർ ഇൻട്രസ്റ്റിംഗ് തിങ്സ് അബൌട്ട് ദ ഫാക്ടേഴ്സ് of the number 28 it is 56 which is equal to 2 times 28 similarly when the factors of 496 are added we get 992 and 992 is equal to 2 times 496 for the number 6 28 and 496 the sums of their factors are all two times the numbers such numbers are called perfect numbers okay so here we can see some other thing that is perfect numbers now perfect numbers nor be fact six edukunu six in the factors edutal 1 2 3 and 6 now if you just add all the factors you will get 12 that is two times of 6 6 into 2 cheyal 12 gettunu the same way factors of 28 also same way factors of 496 okay so ee kittana factors ne ella add cheyumba namaku two times of the numbers kittunu anganeulla numbers ne aanu nammle perfect numbers nu parayne enna ella numbers um perfect numbers alla ipo 8 edukkuvaanengil 1 2 4 and 8 add cheyumba namaku two times of 8 kittathilla okay so these are the special numbers or these are some of the numbers that are perfect numbers Okay, so you can just write down this one. The perfect numbers that is six twenty-eight and four hundred and ninety-six. So these are the perfect numbers. Perfect numbers in the number when we add the factors. Factors in add is the number. Now we get the answer. It will be two times of that of the number. That is your one two one two three and six. If you add one two three yes, and six. Okay, one, two, three, and six. You will get twelve. Twelve is two times of six. Now, same way, twenty-eight. Le one, two, four, seven, fourteen, and twenty-eight. If we add it, we get it as fifty-six, which is two times of twenty-eight. Okay, so I think all of you have finished. So these are called perfect numbers. Idhen ya na perfect numbers. If the sum of the factors of the number is two times of the number. Now, sum me in the factors in a sum me jayi ban two times ana gila. Then in the parayi no perfect. numbers okay i hope that all of you have finished uh, we have completed this we will just summarize it the next perfect number is 8128 in this module you learned that an exact divisor of a number is called its factor The number one is a factor of every number. Every number is a factor of itself. The factors of a number are either less than or equal to the number. No battery. Please charge. All numbers have a finite number of factors. The product of two numbers. is called a multiple of each of the two numbers being multiplied a number is a multiple of all its factors no battery please charge every number 
is a multiple of one and itself. There are infinite multiples of a number. If the sum of the factors of a number is two times the number, then... No battery, please charge. Okay, so students, we can stop here. Um, so we have deal with the factors. Okay, factors and um, and uh, factors and uh, multiples. Okay. Uh, so, Mansila and Larkam Parana? Yes. Okay. So, all of you have yes. understood. Uh, we can stop the class today. Uh, we will meet next week.